Warning, some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. You don't need to be shy around me. You come and approach me. You can pull my hair, approach me. You can whisper in my ear. Just a lot of action would have happened in this trailer. It's crazy. I don't understand the whole wheelchair thing. G'day YouTube, this is Mott from the Black Collar Project and I am at the Lazy Bee Ranch, which is a brothel situated just outside of Fallon, Nevada. This brothel was established in 1975 and ran until 2007. It used to accommodate and serve the local Air Force Base and miners in the area. Rumor has it that a prostitute overdosed in one of the bedrooms at the back. She passed away in this building. Some people have seen the apparition of a woman coming from the building crossing the local interstate. We're going to see if we can communicate with some of the spirits that are attached here and show you around. Don't forget to like like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell for further updates, and let's see what we can find. Rock and roll. Arnold's a whore. Had me in a house just like this, now I'm a whore. No one a man lying on top of me, scared to death, I'm gonna get the roof to see. So this is the room where um, the guys would be drinking, having a jolly time, getting rowdy, and um, there'd be a lounge here and whatever else, music, and the girls would come out here and um, make themselves known to the guys and then be uh, taken back into the back bedroom. So this is the bar area here. It's another little area here. This might've been like more of like an office area or something by the looks of all the furniture here. Now this is about an hour east of Reno. Are there any spirits in here that would like to communicate with me? I'm from Australia. I'm looking for a woman for the night. Can you help me out? I'm just, a woman. Oh my God. It just said, I'm a woman. Well, wow. and that's a coincidence. So yeah, you're a woman. We know you're a woman. You passed away in here. In one of these bedrooms. Which bedroom did you pass away in? Well, did you pass away in the lounge room? I heard you died of an overdose. We got Webby boy here with us. That web. I went in the trailer. Yeah. You get just like quick little tiny spikes in there, and I, I'm not. I haven't even started in, anything yet. Yeah, we've got some orb activity when he was doing his uh, intro as well. This is the kitchen here. What was your name? The woman who died in here. What was your name? We do like to normally investigate places at night time, but this is an occasion where we only got the opportunity to do it in the day. How old were you? Yeah, wow. You can see here there's a lot of stuff on the ground here. It's been uh, ransacked pretty well. Yeah, he, uh, Webb's getting some orb activity as well. This is uh, only a small brothel. There are a lot in the northern Nevada that have been shut down. You can see there's uh, women's shoes over there. Are they your shoes? Quiet. You quiet. This is the kitchen here that they can use. You can come in here and cook up. And there's a separate uh, section. I'll just show you out the back here. It's not far off the interstate, you can see. It's uh, not far at all, just over there. That's the I-50. That's the uh, loneliest highway in America. Knife. Knife. I was just in the kitchen. Grab me a knife. And you can see out here, I'll just show you guys as well. That separate section out the back here was for the miners. And then the uh, Air Force base is nearby. Bank in town for a good boy. I'll get his reward and go into the bedroom. And this one, this is our Oriental room, reserved for the exotic. And most of them are. Home. Oh, wait a minute. This is more like a trailer here. Excuse me, ma'am. 
Can you direct me to the room that you passed away in? There's a lot of feces on the ground here from rodents. Ma'am, did you pass away in this trailer? What was your name? I'm from Australia. I'm, I'm looking for a good time. Are there any available women still here? So I'll uh, go back to the there in the, uh, the main room and we'll try to communicate with the spirit. That's where I seem to get most of the activity before when we're doing a sweep, so we'll go back there and have a look. Normally we like to investigate places at night time, but uh, if there's activity, there's activity regardless. You see this place is starting to fall down, the ventilation and everything here. This would be really hot in summer and really cold in, uh, in winter here. They get a lot of snow. Was that you? Web. What? Oh, you're in there. Something just rattled. I'm getting like very low spike, like not even spike, but like low. Where it makes the noise, but it's not lighting the uh, physical LED up. Is there a lady there that would like to speak to me? I heard you passed away in this brothel. And I'm from Australia, so I'd like to have a girl for the night. Can you come and take me back to the room? I've had a few drinks. You're welcome to take me back. I have a REM pod here and a K2. You can come over here and you can approach them. And let me know that you want to take me back to the bedroom, all right? So I'm going to leave these here for a little while and you can come up to them and approach them, okay? You don't have to be shy. You're a woman of the night. I'm sure you've handled plenty of men before. Are you in the back room? For a woman of the night, you're very shy. You don't need to be shy around me. You come and approach me. I know you probably don't get many Australians come, but here I am. Are you still attached to this location? Or have you moved on? No, not here. It said no, not here. You're not here anymore. That's a shame. I'd like to speak to you. Were you in room number four? Was this your room? So the brothel is uh, for sale, by the way, guys, if you want. It's been on sale for uh, about 13 years now. Nobody wants to buy this thing. It's sitting on the loneliest highway in America, so there's not much out here, really, besides the Air Force Base. The sun's starting to come down. It's beautiful out there. Yeah, we tried to find uh, some information about this place and a name, but... Uh, since it was run by the Hells Angels, it was a lot of shady stuff going on back in the days. A lot of these brothels were run by the Hells Angels up in Northern Nevada. It's so beautiful out here, guys, during the sunset, the desert, and just the color hit, that hits the mountains here. It's just absolutely gorgeous. It's just stunning, like you can see. Look at that. Are you afraid? No, I'm not afraid. Are you afraid? Yeah, I would say it's real. Lots of action will happen on this bed. Did you pass away on this mattress? In the bathroom, if you look at the mirror, there's a bullet hole and then there's a hole on the other side of the wall. So the bullet went through. People have been shooting up the place, eh? So unfortunately there was a brothel down the road not too far, about an hour away that got shut down as well. But uh, that was run by the Hells Angels. And uh, that's actually been boarded up now, so you can't get in. We were lucky to go in there and check it out before it got shut down. Guys, if you like this sort of content, more of an exploration slash paranormal sort of video, hit the thumbs up button for me, guys. Sarah. Sarah, was that your name? Was it Sarah? Was this your room? Sarah? Just a lot of action would have happened in this trailer. <laughs> it's crazy. I don't understand the whole wheelchair thing. You can pull my hair, approach me, you can whisper in my ear. A lot of the people that are driving down the interstate they see you cross the road yeah I appreciate you guys support as well by the way I don't get to thank you enough um, I'm always <laughs> going bull at a gate but uh, sometimes good to just slow things down a little bit but I appreciate all your support guys we're doing really good the channel's doing really well he says toys were they good toys 
well they're adult toys so uh, i guess adult toys can be a good choice but uh i would really appreciate for you to hit that um, subscribe button if you haven't already i'm coming back in for one last time i'm not going to hang around too much longer i've got another location to go to well, you might not like australian guys Squirrel there, guys. Was your name Sarah or Mavis? It's right next door to a uh, the Air Force base as well. That would have been the majority of the clients back then as well. And uh, those, those boys can get pretty rowdy. Oh, it said Anna. Were you one of the prostitutes that worked in here? Was it Anna? So far, you've given me three names: Sarah, Anna, and Mavis. I hope you enjoyed this sort of video guys here at the Lazy Bee Brothel outside of Fallon, Nevada. It's been a cool little explore, nothing too crazy, nothing really paranormal, but it's just good to show you guys what the brothels are like in Northern Nevada, the abandoned ones obviously. But uh, guys, like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell for further updates, and we don't know where we're going to be next, but you'll find out soon. Cheers then guys. Beautiful moon, isn't it? You got that right. Guys, I don't know if you know, but Webb is the other half of the uh, the establishment here, and he's got his own channel as well, Web702. That's you have to Make sure you subscribe to this guy as well, man. He needs the love. We got to get him to a thousand subscribers, and uh, one day he too can be flying over the moon. <laughs>